I must have been a good boy. You're never a good boy. Got a present. They got a present. I'm claiming half ownership. No. Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. It's mine. Sausages at all, Marcus? Are you mincing? Are we having sausages? So exciting. Am I just that sad? No comment. So I might have known when I was instructed to take the grinder apart it was so that I had a, an apprenticeship in it and while Marcus was at work I could be grinding all of the meat up but um, yeah it's all pretty simple to do so I managed to do it so it's got to be reasonably simple I have to say I did put the disc in the wrong way around maybe once maybe twice So we've minced it once, we've added a uh, sausage mix and oh, that's rusk. Not, so that's not mixed, that's just got sausage mix. That's mixed. not mixed. That's not mixed. So that's been mixed and then that's mixed the second time. So Edgy's uh, busy putting it through the second go. And then that's pressed into both. And then we're going to test some burgers. Unfortunately, someone's got to take one for the time. Yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> and Marcus is still chopping. And I've been weighing. So Marcus has gone to work today and he has left me to mix loads of sausages. I've got the mincer set up. I've got my rusk. I've got my seasoning. I've got my scales. It's going into this bucket here. Once this bucket is full, I will then run it through here again and then it will go into the tote. So everything will be double minced and yeah. And then I have another tote to do that is in the uh, freezer. Yep, so I'm going to be busy today and uh, Marcus is trusting me to use the mincer. And uh, I, I have put it together right. Did get a little confused, but um, it's okay. It's, it's together now. What could go wrong? So Bridget is uh, just about to start setting up uh, YouTube, so I've got something to watch while I'm grinding. I've already got my gloves on here, but then I find out I've got the disc on the wrong way round. So I had to turn that round, but then, yeah, plain sailing after that. So at this point Etty decides to come in and steal some of the sausage meat and make burgers for breakfast. She made me some so I mustn't grumble. Okay, round two. Let's turn this into uh, sausage meat.
Well, I got clean hands, so I thought I'd give you an update. This has all been, this is the second tote. This is all mixed um, with the seasoning and that is left to go. It hasn't gone through for the second time. This was feeling a little warm. So I gave it a clean up, gave it a wash, basically just giving it a rest. This does feel a little warm, not massively, um, just not cold, if that makes sense. Basically, I've got to put this whole thing back through it uh, with the addition of this. I had to stop and make more sausage mix um, seasoning. We're down to that with the rusk, so yeah, we're doing pretty well. It's pretty clean, it is working over there. So that's the update. Who likes sausages? I like, <laughs> I like eating sausages. It's yeah. just a lot involved in making sausages. Oh, well, you know, while you were at work, we ground it up and double ground it and mixed it all. I did it all. No, you were at work, you just get to come home and you stuff. Did you not? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I know, it's right? Not all making rust. I know, it's nice not making rust. We actually bought it this time, didn't we? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, we did. Always half done, so. And we bought the skins as well. <laughs> we bought the skins, yeah. We've been slacking. Soon. We're slacking, are we? <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel like it. Hmm. Please tell me it's not broke. Well, we're asking a lot of it. Yeah, it's a small one, considering we used to just do three month batch. I might go and shopping tomorrow. So we did manage to recover from that. Uh, Marcus did have to super glue part of it back, but it worked fine after that. But um, yeah, it's only a five litre entry level stuffer, so it's done as well, considering we only used to do like three months at a time. Uh, definitely by next year, when we have raised some more pigs, we definitely need to upgrade it. It's, um, yeah, we put £93 worth of sausages through it, and uh, yeah, bless it, it, it did struggle, and uh, yeah, it was time consuming. We really liked the uh, grinder, so we went for a number 12, so it wasn't a commercial one, the prices for commercial are very commercial, um, but it was like a professional home one, and I think it did as well, considering we'll probably use it once or twice a year for that quantity. Um, I couldn't ask more of it, I think it did really, really well. It does feel like we are slowly getting there with the equipment to process uh, the animals and yeah we still we still need uh, things but I feel like we're slowly getting them bit by bit and uh, yeah we're really appreciating them when we do get them.